I should not be seen in this area. This is heavily guarded. I should be cautious around here.
Ten now. You are dead. Get out of the way. Move now. Keep the damn safe. And you said you yet. And not there. And bed. Aha, cool. So low. Here, if we're innocent. Gosh, and many. On a chair. Ah, here you are. <gasps> How can I ease the burdens of an old friend? Tonight, we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Ispet's chaos. But Pamu, 
Our champion is nowhere to be found. The High Priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sekhmet bless you. His home is near the market, but check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. Tamu does like a drink now and again.
looking for something in particular? A fair trade. Must be Pamu. Ugh. The man stinks of beer. Oh, thank you. I've been trying to get him to leave for hours. Menahet. That is Pamu! What has happened to him? His passion for toasting Sekhmet has exceeded his head for drink. This is a disaster! People have come from the Red Land and the Black to see him fight! If a fight is all that is needed, I could replace him. Of course, Magi. You honor yourself in saving me from disgrace. Speak to the High Priest in the Temple Courtyard. 
he will take care of the rest. Your Holiness, I am here to fight for Sekhmet. You're not Pamu? He was meant to play Sekhmet. Pamu is... ill. He is recovering at the temple. Fine. Follow me. This is a friendly bout. You must stay vigilant. Do not fear. Sekhmet will receive a fine tribute. Beloved of Sekhmet, who illumines the double land with her flame, we give thanks for your presence on this sacred night. Should malice cling too strongly to your hearts, Isfet, the evil one, shall smite the goddess. Ah! And condemn Yamu to a hundred seasons of darkness. But should your hearts be pure, the goddess shall favor us, shielding us from the obscurity of chaos. Let, Let the battle win. begin! Your fighter can't lose! Since a time unknown, Sekhmet the Lioness has shielded us Wait, from Isfet's Which one is Sekhmet? Greed. And which one is Isfet? Isfet was once husband to Ma'at, goddess of order. Tampering with her scales of judgment, he grew fat on the souls of mortals. Ma'at passed him out of the Hall of Justice. In his hunger, he returned. But Sekhmet knew his heart and guarded the door against him. Their battle lasted 20 days and nights before Sekhmet subdued the Lord of Chaos. Look, his weapon is bathed in Sekhmet's fire. The warrior of Sekhmet beats back Chaos. The lion and his fang will seize the darkness. Look, his weapon is raised in Sekhmet's fire. Sekhmet's might enlivens your arm. The lion and his fangs will cleave the darkness. The warrior of Sekhmet beats back chaos. The lion and his fangs will cleave the darkness. Sekhmet's might enlivens your arm. His weapon is bathed in Sekhmet's fire. You can do it! The warrior of Sekhmet beats back chaos. Sekhmet's might enlivens your heart. The warrior of Sekhmet... I could swear you were the Blood Eater herself. Ah. Oh, the priest's recounting of the battle between the goddess and Isfet was <laughs> new to me. It is a tale of his own invention. You will not hear it outside Yamu. Would that you'd agree to stay with us longer. But I know that greater duties call you. I'll say goodbye to the children before I leave. Do so. They'll miss you. You are always welcome in Yamu whenever your journeys bring you to our gnome. Keep the mask and staff of the goddess as poor tokens of our respect.
God help me. I am coming for you, Aya. Welcome, welcome. use that. Yes, all right. Mm -hmm. Gods guide you, Voyager. <laughs> Oh. 
de popo de ora ca ti afli la fronia. The car is gone. So few Egyptians are coming to tempt them. Where are my Seni and Senu? So sad to see the Serapion so quiet. Set up this. The snake will get his answer. Whoa. Oh! If you're the Santhropon, who can you bear us? No stay to the scrolls. I wrote this. All writings are to be copied oh, by I find I am on all eyes on the scrolls. He has some interesting ideas. Very radical. It's almost a matter You're right about that. But can't he express them concisely? All right, set up this. Now what? Ah, where is Aya? Ah, set up this. I wrote a tragic comic pastoral epic centered on him. Ah, you're by, I guess. Aya is eager to see you. She said. I'm sorry, my good fellow, you appear to be drunk. This library is for serious scholars only.
Onwards and upwards! She is in hiding. Who are you? Ah, interested in Homeric verse, eh? This way, please. I am Aya's cousin, Phanos. Ah, yes, Phanos. Nice to meet you in person. Tell me what is happening with Aya. Why are you being so discreet? Gennadio sent his men on a house-to-house -house search. Often they drag people into the street and torture them for information. Typical of this system we live under. Gennadios. A monster. The Philakitai of Alexandria. He is ravaging the city to find her. And where is she now? I have a very powerful friend. Apollodorus. No doubt you have heard of him. I have not. You will. In any case, he made a hiding place available to Aya after she ran into trouble. Yeah, but what happened? You do not answer me. It is a mess of political intrigue. She will explain all. Fear not. <laughs> Look! There's Phanos. He thinks he's a poet. The modern Sophocles. You must hear his epic poem, Ode to Night. This is as far as I go. The way to Aya is found in the monument ahead. Right there. Have a little faith. <laughs> Never again should we spend months apart. We only have each other. Without him, what? Let us be together. Us two. Each to each. I have news. You are scarred by justice. Ah. I bludgeoned Medunamun with this. I hate that we have to do these things. But I am grateful that you did. If I am honest, I took pleasure in it. Mm. I've missed your touch. I have missed touching you. <laughs> I killed as well. Acteon. I hunted him down and discovered a mask in his room. When he returned, I forced him to wear it. Then I thrust this knife through his eye slits. Aya. But I was careless. Another of the masked ones tracked me to my home. It was even more difficult. We have one more. Then, we will be done. <laughs> Look at this. I took it from Acteon. Apollodorus tells me it is a papyrus from the Royal Council, which means the snake is in Ptolemy's court. How does this Apollodorus know these things? He has informants everywhere, because of his work with Cleopatra. But Cleopatra? She's been declared a criminal. <laughs> By her treacherous brother, yes. She plans to take back the throne. She wants the snake dead as much as we do. And she trusts me. She gave me this to slit his throat. It's an ancient blade that killed the tyrant Xerxes. A weapon of justice.
<laughs> Ingenious. Ah. I will go to the palace and discover who uses the seal of the snake. And I will use this. You'll find plenty of information in the royal scribe's office. He spends his time at the bathhouse. Go search the palace while he's away. And you? I cannot leave here as long as Gennadios walks. What's this? Thank you. 